Hi, welcome to Ajax High School. Like every high school, there's multiple classes you could take. <laughs> like drama, for example. And like every high school, there's certain cliques, certain groups. Let me introduce you to the fellas right here. The chats, the lads, the sigmas. These are just your average group of guys. Kind of basic. <laughs> Over here we have the war kids. You know, some people are a little too excited about certain things. Bosco, what's your favorite war? Vietnam. Okay. <laughs> I got it. As you move up to the stage, state of the art actually. Did you know half the funding at Ajax High actually? Hold the camera. Hold the camera. Fun fact about the stage half the Ajax High funding actually goes here. Speaking of stage, we have the, well, the weird feeder kids. Hey Sam, very good. Just stand less like insecure. Very good, guys. You always need certain people to take the class. Seriously. Like me, for example. Very thankful I can direct and sort of lead this entire thing, but... Dude, you for the final time, not this every, is not your not idea, every, Ethan. What, what are you... Ethan, come on, stop. Seriously. No, it's... Like, Ethan, I'm sick of this. You didn't come up with this. This is my idea. Calm down. I yeah, invited you. You're probably wondering, what production are we even doing? <laughs> it's a big deal, I must say, but it's High School Musical, actually. Which would mean that this sort of mockumentary thing is High School Musical, the musical, the mockumentary. Hi. It's very interesting, really. You know, we haven't had one since COVID and the pandemic and all that, but... It looks like drama's back in action. So, uh, you know, I think there's, a, there's another group supposed to... So High School Musical, I've never directed this before, I'm not going to lie, I have some concerns. I don't know if anyone in the class can actually sing. In fact, I'm doubtful that anyone can sing. So I'm expecting to direct a lip syncing air band. And that is so much fun because I do know they can dance and those who can't dance are going to try their hardest to move their feet to the beat. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Who's going to play which role? Again, I think Charles could play every single part in this musical. I think he could be a one-man show. Well, yeah, I, I can, I, I'm pretty confident in the fact that I, I'm sure I can play really any character in the musical. I don't know. Tomorrow the auditions start and I'm excited to see who looks right for the part. And we'll see how they can sing on Thursday and then we'll see how they can dance on Friday and we'll try to put it together and it's anyone's guess at this point. All right, everyone, we're gonna start working on monologues today. Now, this is the art of the solo performance. I want you to have these memorized. I want you to have your focal point. I want you to have a costume piece, maybe a prop for stage business. These are gonna be starting this week, so prepare tonight. Any questions? Like, like this? Are you watching this? Okay, yeah. If I, I calculated it, I would go from paying $28 to 150 Hey, my name is Kiefer. Um, I am looking to go for either Troy or Chad. Um, I'm not entirely sure who else is going for the role, but I do believe that uh, Sam Shaw is also going for uh, Troy. Uh, I am excited for my monologue. Uh, I've got a funny one, and I'm excited to share it with people and just make people laugh and kind of show off some of my abilities. Uh, Action. Okay. Hi, my name is Bella Bajoni. I'm in grade 12. I'm the SAC Vice Prime Minister. Um, and this year I was thinking of going for Gabriella. I'm not really sure who else is going for her, but hopefully I get the part. Um, also, my monologue that I'm doing, it's kind of like one where the girl in it is excited, and that's really different from what I usually do. It's usually like way more dramatic stuff, but Ms. Prescott told me to do it, so <laughs> hopefully it works. Uh, and I also just wanted to say, we all said we were going to wear red today. Did you see what Callie was wearing? That's literally pink. She's wearing pink. Oh, quick, sorry, sorry, quick, quick question here. So what do you think this color is right here? Red. Yes, so in reflection to um, like what you, you know, have on here, what, what, would you, what would you say with that? Red. You would say red? It's red. 
Hi, my name is Callie. Um, in the play, I'm not sure what I want to be. Maybe I want to be a basketball at this point. I kind of don't know. Uh, monologue, I'm not really sure how I feel about it. I mean, it's a monologue. I kind of don't want to do it, but like, whatever. Um, I forget what else I'm supposed to say. Today is the first day of our audition series. I hope you're all feeling ready. Woo! Okay, we have eight people coming up to deliver monologues today. After each monologue, they're gonna sit here, stand here, while you give some positive feedback. In five, four, three, two, one. So today was the first day of monologue auditions. They went really well. What stands out to me Sam Shaw did really great physicalization on stage. Um, Charles as um, uh, Lord Palatine, the Sith Lord, was terrifying. And then he wanted to audition for Miss Darvis, which was a shock, I'm not going to lie. Um, him playing like a Miss Doubtfire character uh, hadn't really crossed my mind, but maybe. And let's see, Bellas was really sweet. She was really sweet. Um, she looks great in those flowery dresses. We need, we need girly girls in this musical for sure. What else happened? Uh, Luke's going to burn our house down with lemons. That was an exciting monologue too. Can't really picture where he fits in in this musical. He's kind of, he's kind of out there. They're all kind of out there, but this means it's going to be an eccentric, crazy, fun musical. Well, that was uh, maybe one of the greatest and funniest monologues I've ever done. You know, since grade nine, I've always wanted to be an actor, and uh, I really enjoyed uh, the part where I got to grab my ass in front of the whole audience. Um, what do you think of Bella? Mm, yeah, she's going for Gabriella. I'm going for Troy. It just works, you know? She was really good. I think everything she does in audition and everything she does whenever, whatever, it just works. It all works together. She's just amazing. She's just one of the most amazing people, especially when it comes to acting. Am I looking at the camera? You can look at me or Ethan or the camera, it doesn't really matter. Okay, I just, I just, like, so I just set up my props and everything, I had a mirror, had some brushes, a bit more than like other people, so I thought it was pretty good. And you know, I'm looking to get Taylor. She's one of the mains. Um, I think I killed it. Got the emotion in there, and you know, I don't really know if Taylor's an emotional girl, but I'm ready to bring that to her, and I think I'd be a great candidate, so yeah. I am the Senate. I'm Isabel Tetley. I'm going for the role of Gabriella. My audition went pretty great. No one else did their own song and dance, um, so I deserve the lead role because I'm obviously the star of the drama class. So, we have a cast, and it's a great cast! Really excited to see this group hit the stage. I think we have the best Gabriella and Troy, they're gonna be adorable. They are living and breathing this part already, I could see from the start. Do you know, I'm really surprised though, I really thought Isabel Tutley was gonna be all over Sharpay. Isabel is the saucy Sharpay! Are you kidding me? Are you actually stupid? Whoa. This is so unfair. <laughs> go, go, go. and called me stupid for casting her as Sharpay. So, caught me off guard, not gonna lie. Um, I think we're both pretty excited to have gotten. I'm definitely excited. Yeah, we're really yeah. excited. I mean, Isabel's not as excited. <laughs> that was I, weird. That was That was so weird. So embarrassing. How are you not embarrassed? Like, like who please? walks out? Who, who walks out? Have you ever heard of showmanship? Like, yeah, we're... honestly. I think we're both just really excited. Very excited. Software. It's voice memos. It's did you, where's the, did you turn it on? No. It's the 
I don't use Thank Apple, you, you Hi, I'm Ethan. I'm the one you see running this entire thing. It's, I'm the one you. See, I'm the. Uh, I'm the one you see running half of this thing. Half, fifty percent. Uh, it's a. It's an equal process. Uh, I'm going to Trent for business administration. I'm going to specialize in economics. I'm very excited for that. I'm going with Marcello here. I'm going with Marcello here. Okay. So I'm very excited for that. I got the role of Jack Scott uh, in the musical. I don't know who Jack Scott is, but I'm very excited. What's up? I'm Marcello. I'm going to university next year. I applied for Trent for like a teaching program, but I'm best friends with Ethan. This guy's an idiot. Today during the drama class, Isabel had a little outburst. It was a uh, rather strange considering, like, <laughs> strange considering the way that it was put, because she got a part and I didn't exactly get a part. <laughs> but either way, it is what it is, so I'm happy about it. Stop throwing oh. that. Stop. I'm literally so mad right now. Like, <laughs> It's such a typecast. It's so unfair. I just got cast as the bitch in the play because I'm a bitch in real life. And Luke getting Ryan. Don't even get me started. That is just pure nepotism. He's not even a good actor. Okay, so I got the role of Ryan. I'm pretty happy about it. I really wanted any supporting role with lines, so uh, this suits me well, I guess, since it has lines. <laughs> uh, I, I like the hats and, and like the flamboyant stuff he wears. I've been told it suits me well, so we'll see how well that, how well that goes. And I'm pretty excited to work with Sharpe. You already know my thoughts. I got the role of Chad. Uh, I'm excited to play this character. I liked him a lot in the movie, so I'm excited to bring it to life. Um, I got the role of Victoria, or... <laughs> <laughs> can't, can't. No, keep going, keep going, just keep going. Just okay. I got the role. I stopped uh, recording. What do you mean? What? what? Never <laughs> recording. I'm Victoria. I got the role as Taylor, who is Gabriella's bestest friend and um, Chad's love interest. So we're gonna be playing <laughs> that during the play. Any words, Chad? Um, it's gonna be great. It's gonna be interesting. Looking forward to. For it. sure. For sure. Um, if you're wondering what happened to my finger, because I know everyone really cares. Hi. <laughs> Hi, I'm Layla. I'm very tired right now, and, um, yeah, great to be here. I don't know what I'm doing. What's, what's your role? <laughs> and I'm playing Miss Tenny. Apparently she's a math teacher. I have not read the script. I'm Ashley. I'm playing Miss Darbus. Um, thoughts on my role? Super excited to be in, like, the main cast. Um, was very humble to find out my role does not include any singing nor dancing for this musical, but you know what? I'm here for the experience. Musical. So. I'm Kelsey in the play. I'm really excited. I am Jack Scott <laughs> uh, in the play. I am, I'm very excited. <clears throat> Waiting for Samantha to get in here. This girl, literally, she thinks she can act, she thinks she can sing. She's yeah. not ready for She's not ready for it. She doesn't know half the stuff right now. Yeah. Marcello, get out of here! Hey, Charlie. Let me see Okay. Hi, I'm Sam. Um, I got the role of Martha. Um, I wasn't here for my auditions, but I still got a really good role from my dancing skills, and yeah. Nice. yeah. Um, my name's Simone, I run half of the mockumentary. <clears throat> Sorry. More than half. Sorry. Um, Sorry. My, you can Sorry. <laughs> my role is um, Ripper, yes, that's his name. Um, and I have what, like two, three lines in Sticky Status Quo, and I play the cello, so. Love. I mean, like, I did do a whole dance audition and didn't get a better role, so I'm a bit salty <laughs> about that, but. It's okay. <laughs> um, before Isabel comes in, I thought her meltdown was really weird, and I'm not sure I should be doing this interview with her. Like, I, I think something bad might happen to me. Um, I got the role of Zeke. Um, you know, I'm a jock, I'm a baker, I'm in love with Sharpay. What type of Charles do you want to be? 
Well, there's many Charleses out there. Uh, Ray Charles, James Charles, um, uh, Charles in Charge. Uh, there's also Charles Manson. Uh, Charlie Chaplin too, actually. Charlie Chaplin. Uh, a lot of Charleses out there. Um, one's blind, one's a um, uh, sussy man, and the other is a murderer. <laughs> Ended up getting Coach Bolton, you know, I'm pretty okay with that. Not too many singing roles, but still pretty important, so. What, who'd you get? I got, I got the role of um, a few people. I got the decathlon moderator. I already got the neck beard, so I'm uh, good on the moderator part, like Reddit. Uh, and also, I'm either going to be a skater, a jock, or a nerd. Mm. It's going to be pretty cool. I, I probably only got like a total of two lines plus a little bit of singing. It's going to be fun. Anyway, so here we are. She, I think, is a hostile participant now in this musical, and I'm just going to work with that. We're just going to channel that into Sharpay. It's going to be good.